we're solving true, false, or sometimes true, and sometimes false questions. In an SMP, stable marriage problem, instance with n greater than zero, so there's at least one man and one woman, being solved by the Gale Shapley algorithm with men proposing, at least one of the women marries the first man that proposes to her. Well, let's start with the simplest possible case and see what happens. So we've got one man and one woman. Obviously the man prefers the woman and the woman prefers the man. That's their preference list. And they have to marry each other. And how will this run? Well, man one will propose to woman one and she will accept. So this is an example of where it's true. So we can just, uh, we can just grab this example and I'm just gonna label it one man, one woman. And I'll just say one proposal. So clearly she accepts the first proposal. So this is not never true. Let's see. Um, let's just try a bigger example. Hmm. I'll try M1, 1, 2, 3, and 2, 3, 1, 2, and 3, 3, 2, 1, W1, uh, 2, 3, 1, W2, 1, 2, 3, and W3, uh, 1, 2, 3. She'll have the same preferences. So we'll have man one propose to woman one, and she will accept because she's not engaged yet. And then man two will propose to woman three, and then man three will propose to woman three, and will she accept? No, she'll reject his proposal, so we'll just dash that in. And then he'll propose to woman two, and we're done. When this ends, this always ends with the last man who is unmarried making a proposal and having it be accepted. The last man, the last man who's unmarried. So let's, let's just have some big complex example, M1 to MN and W1 to WN. And we're right at the end of the loop. And, and this man right here makes a proposal to someone. Now imagine, so to this woman, now imagine that she rejects his proposal. Well, then that's not the last proposal that, that the man makes. He's going to have to make a later proposal. So we can ignore that case. Now imagine that she's already engaged and she accepts his proposal. Then she breaks it off with some other man. So, so in that case, there is this other person over here who becomes unmarried. And so again, this person isn't really the last man proposing because this person is then gonna to have to propose later on. So we can ignore that case too, if we're really thinking about the last man proposing, he doesn't get rejected. He isn't accepted by someone who's already engaged. The only other option is that he's accepted by someone who is not yet engaged. That's the only other outcome in the algorithm. So this actually has to end with the last woman accepting a proposal from the last man, and she was unengaged. And once a woman becomes engaged, she's always engaged. She may change who she's engaged to, but she's always engaged. So let's see. This is, this is always true. The last proposal in the last loop iteration cannot be rejected or another iteration is needed to engage all men or accepted by an engaged woman or her 
former fiance needs further iterations. Okay, I'm going to need to clear some space here. This is a complex question. Okay, so that's step one. So the last proposal, uh, therefore, so therefore, that proposal is accepted by an unengaged woman. But once engaged, women remain engaged, if not necessarily to the same man. So, the last woman accepting was always unengaged before that point, and therefore she accepts this, her first proposal. So this is always true because that last proposal is always of the form of a man proposing to a woman who is so far unengaged. And the reason that happens is because we have equal numbers of men and women in the stable marriage problem. And just by the structure of the loop, the last iteration has to end with everybody married off. The second to last iteration has to end with one person still to be married off on each side, one man to be married off, one woman to be married off, because it's forming a perfect matching as it goes. And so if there's one man to be married off, which there has to be so we can have that last iteration, there has to be one woman, and that's who he has to propose to, or else he will be rejected or cause an existing engagement to be broken off.